so hey guys welcome back once again and in this video i'm gonna talk about one of the most interesting thing one of the most fun thing or like i can say important thing that you need to know about stable diffusion so in today's video basically i'm gonna talk about prompt sr you can see over here on like if you select on xyz plot over here you will get a lot a lot of like scripts over here so in order to that i'm gonna talk about prompt sr today and yes it's very important thing and yes one of the most fun thing to do like in stable diffusion so basically in this video i wanted to go deep into like camera control as one of the viewers just asked me how to get good on camera control so i just said him that there are some models like protogen models that are trained in order to get good camera controls as you can see over here in protogen on description you can see there are camera controls commands given over here from above from below from side as you can see over here even movement control things like these things are given on like protogen models so there are some models in order to go with like camera control and there is also link given want to like comprehensive guide to camera control over here if you click on to like this link you will get a guide to like camera controls as you can see over here this is the link they have shared with like on protogen model so there are some models who are trained to get good camera controls so basically in this video i'm not going into deep about like camera control i will make a detailed video about it later but if you want to check like multiple things on your prompt then let me tell you this is one of the fun thing to do that's prompt sr let me explain you what is prompt sr so basically prompt sr stand for search and replace prompt search and replace what it does is that if you add tokens or prompts over here it will replace this prompt first prompt as you can see over here this is the prompt that i'm using shot from above raw photo of shot of a male model so it will replace this thing male model as you can see over here i have already added male model female model and old model so you need to first of all add the thing that is in the prompt as you can see male model over here from the prompt male model over here and then go on adding like female model and old model or whatever you want like to change this thing like first prompt so basically i wanted to change like male model to like female model and like old male model you can see over here this is the result that i got with the same prompt but three different result male model female model and old model the prompt remains the same with male model over here but the result with every three model over here so as you can see prompt sr is one of the most important thing i can definitely say and yes one of the most fun thing that you can go and experiment with like you can get different different result with like this thing so i can definitely say that yeah it's very fun and most important thing so guys this time what we will do is that this time we will focus on clothes and let's see what result do we get so as i said earlier first of all you need to add what's in your prompt as steampunk clothes over here as you can see over here i have already added steampunk clothes over here and then formal clothes and funky clothes so this time we are going with like formal clothes and like funky clothes as well so basically what it does is that let me explain you one more time it searches these words on your prompt like steampunk clothes over here on your prompt and replaces it with like formal clothes and like funky clothes so basically that's how you will get multiples of results okay so this is how you get multiples of result and now let's check on what result do we get so guys as you can see this is the result that we got pretty much amazing result over here you can see over here i have already added steampunk clothes formal clothes and funky clothes so this is the result that we got like steampunk clothes formal clothes and funky clothes i don't know what funky is it but yeah this is the result that we got pretty amazing result and yes pretty handy as well in order to like you can go on like experiment and get like multiples of result with like multiples of prompt so now guys let's try one more time as i've already said that protogen models are trained under for like camera control as i've already shown you that fun camera prompts are given on like protogen model from above from below from side as you can see over here these are the result that i got with like from above shot from above over here so these are the result that we got pretty amazing these two are like shot from above but this time we will check on like four different things as well just like protogen said from above as well from below from side and from behind as well so let's try this time like camera control and let's see what result do we get first of all copy the text that you want to focus on like from above i have copied this first of all paste that over here and then edit the another prompt as well you can see i have already edited and let's see what result do we get this time we will get like four result so let's see what result do we get so guys this is the image that we got with like camera control as you can see over here this is the result that we got pretty amazing result from above as you can see not much above but yes definitely it's from above and from below as you can see over here it's like a straight angle 
but yeah the result is amazing and on from side as well you can see amazing result and from behind as well so basically i wanted to go deep into like camera control but yes i found this topic very important of like prompt sr i found this very important and i wanted to make this video as soon as possible and wanted to keep it as short as possible so i will definitely go in deep on like camera control but yeah next time that's it for today i hope so guys you like this video actually i wanted to keep it as short as possible and yes this is very important thing as as I've already shown you that you can get multiples and multiples of results with like one generation only. So most fun thing and yes, very important thing as well. That's it for today. I hope so guys you like this video and yeah, I will be back with more and more videos tomorrow. Till then have a good day. Bye guys and love you all guys. Bye guys.